Hello, my brother priests, deacons, and seminarians. This is Father Frank Pavone, director of Priests for Life, bringing you suggestions for preaching pro-life on the 23rd Sunday of the year, Cycle A. The Church's approach in the midst of the culture of death can be described as a call to be loving watchmen. We are to be watchmen on the wall. We are to admonish the sinner, as the prophets and the Lord Jesus tell us. And admonishing the sinner is an act of love, especially in a culture of death where that admonishment against abortion may in fact, and will in fact, save lives. We admonish the sinner because we've been given the revelation of what is right, we've been given the grace to do what is right at all times. And the work of this leads to the various kinds of work in the pro-life movement, advocacy for the unborn and for their parents, intervention to save lives and to stop the killing. And it is not just one segment of the pro-life movement that's motivated by love. All the different activities of the movement are motiv motivated by love. Not just those that are directly serving the women and men in need, but also those that are protesting the killing centers and those that are in hostile environments in legislative assemblies and courts where they're advocating for the lives of the defenseless. This is all a work of love. And when the Lord Jesus says, where two or three are gathered in my name, I am there, we might ask, why does he mention two or three? It's because when there is the presence of the other person, then we learn what it means to give ourselves away in love and to receive that love from them. And when we give ourselves away in love to make room for the other, to defend the other, then we find the presence of the Lord Jesus who gave himself away that we all might have life.